It's it's because it's coming. Oh, this that fucked. <laughs> It's fine, mate. <laughs> Let's cut that out. Yeah, maybe. maybe well, I might leave it. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, with the gain structure of amps, it's it's completely different. Hey guys, welcome back to Dipswitch Demos. Welcome back to Forty Two Gear Street Two as well. I'm sat next to John Brown. I'm sure you'll know who he is, and I wanted to get you in a video so we could check out the Soldano. Which is actually over this shoulder right here behind yeah. me. We could probably switch to the camera, actually. There you go. <laughs> yeah. And I've had that on my channel already. But... I know, and I've seen your video. And okay. I basically wanted to try it out because this sort of amp is so alien to someone like me. Okay. I'm very more, very much more used to single channel, clean, pedal platform sort of things. And okay. I know this can do that. It can definitely But there's a lot more going on and there's some... some also wall gain as well. <laughs> <laughs> it can literally do everything from the nicest pristine cleans through to, you know, death. What you death. would consider death. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, it's just such a versatile amp and it's like, I was doing a, a video actually with Sam Bell yesterday Yeah. and I plugged him into an angle. Yeah. Now, angle is kind of associated with the heavy metal thing, mm -hmm. but they've had Richie Blackmore on the roster, they've had Steve Morse on the roster, yeah. and a bunch of other like really versatile players so one thing that i'll always say is even if you think an amp might not suit what you're going for the basis of all amps is kind of the same yeah. and it's to amplify the guitar so you might actually find something really unique that you love well we've got we just did a little sound check now and pretty much everything is at 12 and i'm already loving it <laughs> <laughs> it sounds so good just that's yeah it's that low gain um slightly broken up Clean. Exactly, but there's there's yeah. some push in like the low mid range that's really pumping out a bit. It's really thick, isn't it? Yeah, it's just. But good. still, I'm sure that's going to clean up really nicely as well. <laughs> I mean. It's, we're starting from a good place. How's about I go back there, try dialing in something from clean through to low gain crunch, maybe something with a little bit of more of a soaring lead if you're yeah. into it. Yeah, I want to try some, you know, get see how brutal we can get as well, because that's going to be fun. Cause <laughs> all, <I'm... laughs> all you got to do is play E and F together, man. Do the Metallica. Exactly, there you go. See. Yeah, he's got it. So I'll go back there and tweet, get you a nice clean sound. Then we'll flick to the crunch mode on the clean sound as well, because there's a crunch switch. There's also a bright switch as well for cool. you know giving it a little bit more spank. I know you're into that. You know, we all are. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yeah, let me go back there and sweep. Um, yeah, it's a really good amp. So controls are, um, you know, it's a shared EQ. I'm just gonna put this down there, actually. It's got a shared EQ of bass, middle, and treble. Uh, a preamp gain for each channel, uh, a volume for each channel, and presence and depth. Um, and then the two switches, so, shall we? Let's do it. You play Yeah, <laughs> even just that clean sound. And the string separation as well, you can hear every, every note in a chord. Every individual note, and we're still on the clean channel now with uh, with the preamp gain up to about 9 o'clock, no sorry, yeah. 3 o'clock. And yeah. the sound, just that so you know, goes up to 11. 
<laughs> of course. <laughs> Should we give the crunch channel a little flip? Let's do it. Go on, give us a play. <laughs> That's already more gain than I'm used to. Really? Yeah. If, yeah. If, any, if I go, I mean, I love it, yeah. but if I'm using more gain than that, it's always a fuzz. Oh, really? Is yeah, it? so amp gain is sort of new to me, <laughs> 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 which is a weird thing to think about. just a tiny little bit there to give it more of that well I kind of scoop the mids out a little bit on clean sounds yeah so me just, too just for me a too. little bit of you know fenderiness yeah or... I guess so yeah but sometimes it just works I mean obviously you get you don't get the thickness hmm. um, but it just sounds good sometimes you know yeah it just <laughs> and, sounds good <laughs> yeah, yeah. and the Soldano is a particularly mid heavy amp is it okay. yeah so just cutting it a little bit for clean sounds I found helped a lot Mm. Um, so do you want to try the most disgusting overdrive channel in the world? I think I'd quite like to try that. Okay, well let's try the gain being quite low. Let's be reserved at the moment. So let's I, I, I can imagine it's already going to be pretty high for me. <laughs> So basically, the gain on that was at nine o'clock. <laughs> not even, not yeah, even. Yeah, I mean, I dined it a little bit when you were doing some of the chords, but yeah, I mean, I can tell by your playing that you're more like of a, a sort of tight, sort of low gain sound. And funnily enough, same as me. Yeah. <laughs> I hardly run any gain on my on my gain sounds, but it's all about the attack that gets the kind of power. Well, then, you know I when guess. you find that sweet spot between too much gain and not enough, and mm. it just sort of spanks the note. That's yeah. kind of what I'm looking for. And then any extra gain, I'll sort of do a volume boost in front of the amp. Yeah. That's kind of what makes the most sense to me. Yeah. Anyway, but yeah, what do you think? I fucking love it, man. It's really, a really, really like thick it. sounding amp, isn't it? I mean, I could get used to that gain as well. <laughs> You get used to whatever you play to, don't you? Yeah. Eventually, so like, I'm just really surprised that you're not like a uh, an amp guy when it comes to gain structure. No, it's just something I've not really tried and spent enough time with different amps to kind of experiment with and get to know. It's it's because it's coming. Oh, this that. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's fine, mate. <laughs> 
Let's cut that out. Yeah, maybe. maybe well, I might leave it. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, with the gain structure of amps, it's it's completely different mm. to pedals. Yeah. Like with pedals, you're kind of because you're going into the front end of the the amp, you're sort of it's sort of on top of what's going on with the amp. Whereas when the amp's designed with the with the distortion circuit, it's kind of refined to work with everything else that's going on. Yeah. Yeah, and. It's a completely different sound. I know you can get amp in a box type pedals, but you know yeah. they don't often get close to things like this. No, like the the way that an amp's designed is the entire circuit is meant to work uh, as well. Of course, one. yeah. And if you don't like the distortion on an amp, that's fine. Just mm. try a different amp. Yeah. Even though they're all quite similar <laughs> in their construction, you yeah. Know? There's only so many so many ways that you can make overdrive and gain. You know, it's all the little yeah. little bits, isn't it? So. But that's, that amp is fucking amazing. I'm sorry I'm, to swear on your channel. It's all right. I can't. I've not decided if I'm going to bleep anything out because people have been swearing all the time, and I don't really care. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm glad you liked it. That's one of those amps. That, um, try it through a cab. Yeah, I can imagine that makes a big difference. Being able to feel it push the air. It's it's got the most power I've ever heard from any amp. Wow. Well, yeah. So. Well, thank you so much for coming on the video, man. It's all right. Coming all over it. Coming um, all over <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> this it's been really eye-opening and Thank you. i might need to check out one of those soldanos slo 30 slo 30 slo 30 yeah there's a 100 as well isn't there there is a 100 and they say this is 30 watt right but it's got two 6l6s in it yeah and apparently they've dropped the wattage of it but it, I, I had it at two and i thought i was gonna die yeah i think the 100 scares me a bit yeah just the idea of it it's going to be ridiculously loud, and Soldano is known for being ridiculously loud. It's one of those, yeah, one of those things. <laughs> well, thank you, man. I will round it, round it up there. Thank uh, thanks for checking out the video, guys. If you like more, please go subscribe and check out some more videos. If you like more, um, and check out the hashtag Forty Two GS Two to follow all the content from Forty Two Gear Street. We're having a good time. It's the last day today. Uh, we're all flagging a bit, but that's fine. Um, yeah, thanks, John. I'll thank see you in the very next much. video. And he's got six socks. Oh, I do. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I run out of train socks. No, <laughs> six socks. I love them. Cheers, guys. Thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe I'm scared to turn around.